it's hurting the whole parish. It's just like being violated, taking things that are they're so meaningful to so many people in this area, and now they're just gone. It's believed this past weekend someone got inside St. John's Catholic Church in Dinwiddie County. Well, it was Wednesday, and I came just to check on the church because we hadn't been using it for services. That's when Ray discovered an open side door. So I opened it up and yelled, is anybody here? You know, who's here? Because I thought, well, maybe it was someone came in to water the plants. Moments later, Ray would realize why the door was ajar. And I noticed one of the statues was missing. And then I started looking around and noticed a few other things missing. For Father Joe Goldsmith. What happens when somebody breaks into a, um, to a very, very important, very uh, a sacred space? And it's not a nice feeling. While the items stolen have a monetary value in the thousands, their real value. It hurts the heart. Is priceless. Well, it's like you're violated. I mean, the, uh, most of the stuff that was stolen has been here all of my life. Among about a dozen missing items, this piece of art. Where there's just an empty wall there now, we had a piece of artwork uh, at least 100 years old from, from Czechoslovakia. Also missing a chalice, a processional cross, and... They stole baby Jesus from a Catholic church. For the parish priest, he has a message to the thief. You've broken into the church. You know, break a little deeper into what God wants for your life, and he will, and he will show you something good. Come on, I really mean that. For parishioners... Personally speaking, I'd like for whoever took them just to bring them back, put them on the doorstep, and we'll... You know, because, I mean, it's just, it hurts. Among the other items that are missing are two incense sensors and a small figurine. Dimity County Sheriff's Office asks if you have any information about the theft to call Crime Solvers at 861-1212. Working for you, Wayne Koval, CBS 6 News.